Rhett just walked in the door, had to run upstairs, as you can see, got all the soccer stuff on. He literally has a few minutes to take a bite of his meal. Hi. How was school? Good. Okay, I got you guys something to eat. You gotta hurry. You guys have a chair. Are you doing homework? Mm-hmm, totally. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tia, just tell me, did you do your homework already? Mm -hmm. Promise? Yeah, I promise. <laughs> Thank you HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. Good afternoon you guys, it is two o'clock in the afternoon. My kids will be getting home from school any minute. And yes, I just got ready at two o'clock in the afternoon. That's usually how it goes. With Corey and I going to the gym in the morning, getting this new back to school routine has been a little bit of a transition, but it's, it's been good. We get up, we go to the gym, come home, do like all the household stuff, get videos edited, all that jazz. And now the kids get ready to come home and we have to make sure they're fed and ready for all of their activities because Monday through Friday, my kids are busy. We have kids in cheer, we have kids in dance, we have kids in tumbling, we have kids in soccer, we have kids in basketball. So we are busy Monday through Friday. The second my kids get home from school, it is go time. They get in, we hurry and get them fed, which I'm so excited because today's video is actually sponsored by HelloFresh. And I cannot wait to share with you easy, quick recipes that will feed your entire family. HelloFresh is delicious. One thing I love about it is each week they offer new recipes that you can pick from that will help you break out of your recipe rut. This week I got cheesy chipotle barbecue quesadillas, creamy chicken and mushroom cup of toffee and smothered pepper jack burgers. But today, I think I'm going to actually cook the cheesy chipotle quesadillas because I love that it's only 10 minute prep time, 25 minutes to cook. Save up to 28% by using HelloFresh versus grocery store shopping. Feeding a family has never been easier with larger box sizes for more savings. I should also point out that there is something for everyone with HelloFresh. Low calorie, vegetarian, and family friendly recipes. HelloFresh pre-proportioned ingredients means less prep time for you and less wasted food. HelloFresh donated 2.5 million meals to charity in 2019 and is stepping up its food donation amid the coronavirus crisis. Rhett just walked in the door, had to run upstairs, as you can see, got all the soccer stuff on. He literally has a few minutes to take a bite of his meal. Cause this is it, you guys. So he he goes, how long, Corey? He's there for at soccer for an hour and a half, two hours. He is gonna be starved if he doesn't eat now. I'm still waiting for Reese and Perry to get home. Kesley just walked in the door too. Brett and Kesley usually get home about the same time. Perry and Reese get home about a half hour later than them. So they should be here soon. Here you go, Rhett. Here is yours. Here's Kesley's. Mmm, it's delicious. Mm, not yummy. The Barbecue quesadilla. Brett's out of here. Yeah. See how quick Reese and Percy walk in the door any second. Have fun. Do a good job at your practice. Bye. Bye. Oh, I see them. They're right there. Hi. How was school? Good. Okay, I got you guys something to eat. You gotta hurry. You guys have a chair. Yeah. They're gonna love dinner. Guys, yummy barbecue quesadillas. There you go. There you go. If you want to try HelloFresh, go to HelloFresh.com, link is in the description. Use code Leroy's80 to get $80 off with a purchase, including free shipping on your first box. So we got the kids out the door. We got Reese and Perry off to tumbling. And Corey is with Rhett at soccer practice. And it's just me and Kess. And this is usually how it goes. Kess and I will just sit here and chat for a little bit, catch up. She usually does her homework while the kids are gone. 
gets caught up with school. Look at her, she's so tired. And then after all of her homework's done, usually she goes and hangs out with a friend or her friends come over. That's like a nighttime thing they do throughout the, the week. Friends? Actually tonight, I wanna watch the movie It, but I don't know if I wanna go. It's scary, it's a scary movie. Well, no, we already watched the first one. They wanna watch the second one though. There's two know. of them? Yeah, I guess. Where are you guys watching that? Oh, I think gonna... they want to watch it in my room with like projector <laughs> things. That's why I'm like, I don't know. I know, Kes, like, okay, so Kes has her old projector from our basement in her room right now because we don't have a, any, the basement's not done, which, in fact, you know what? I'm gonna take you guys downstairs while we have a minute because, let me show you. So those of you who don't know, we're getting our basement done and we are about 70% finished. It's getting closer and we are for sure gonna have it done by Christmas, which makes me so happy. It's been a long process. This wall, right here is gonna be taken out, about to about right here. This whole door will be gone. We got some of the electrical done. This is the only light, the only light right now that works. They came in and installed all that in the ceiling with the electrical, with the plumbing done. Next after this is drywall, and that should be starting in the next three or four days, and that should be pretty quick. And then we go on to picking out, like we're gonna do built-ins right here. We got our everything ready for my sink. My sink's gonna go right here. I'm gonna put some built-in cabinets right here, like a mini fridge, an ice maker, sink. And then I don't know if I'm gonna put a bar out here. I just wanna have it as open as I can because I'm gonna have a lot of kids down here. Projector screen, we even got the projector cord thing right there installed. And then this is our wood floor from upstairs. We're not doing this floor, but we're actually gonna get a laminate that looks like this. This is real wood that's upstairs and I don't love the real wood. I'm gonna get laminate down here, it matches this. So I'm thinking a workout room, a small one will be here. Then bathroom right here. And then right over here, this is a whole storage room that has, it goes clear back there. This is supposed to be Reese's room. My suspicion is, and I'm not 100% sure this will happen. My suspicion is Kesley's gonna see this room when it's done. And she's gonna say, I wanna go down there. And then what's gonna happen is Reese will be more than happy to take Kesley's bedroom upstairs and Kesley will come down here. That's my suspicion, I could be totally wrong. So this is the closet here and they're actually gonna take this out right here and this is gonna be knocked out and we're gonna put a built-in, like make a really cute desk space right there. It's gonna be nice. That is the basement update. I'll keep you guys updated more as we go. I cannot wait, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, look. Look, it looks like somebody's in my pantry and she's like, the door is closed. <laughs> Guys, it is 5.33 at night and Reese and Perry are gonna be back any minute from cheer. And I made them like a little snack. And that's usually something that kind of ties them over because they're still fairly full from dinner, but they always you know, want something else to have. So we always have a little snack when they get home. They just got home from cheer and <laughs> Reese ran across the street to go get Bailey. She, as soon as the door opened, she saw Reese and Perry and booked it. So, Reese got her. No, no, run away. No, 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 run away. Perry wanted to show everybody the pumpkins out on the porch. So this is my, my dad's, dad's and Kesley's. Okay. Yes. My mom's, my mom is the girl because she has the purple binky, even though that's my favorite And the bow. And the headband. And, and mine's the boy, the green binky, and with black and white striped thingies. And then, and then mine is weird. <laughs> it's filling up. Come eat, you guys. Come have some yes. snacks. I and then, adults. and then we gotta get started on homework. You have to read 20 minutes tonight. And guess what? Guess what? Reese is doing at school right now. Do you want to tell him? We're doing um. States and capitals. States and capitals. And it's we've been so we've been working on them. Let's 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 ask you a few right here, okay? What is the capital of? Nevada. Crescent City. Okay. What is the capital of Hawaii? Honolulu. Honolulu. What is the capital of Wyoming? Hmm. I know this one. You know this one. Remember how I told you how to remember it? You're not shy. Cheyenne. 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 That's right. We, we have ways of learning these. Okay, so they're gonna finish drinking up their protein shakes and their food. They got their water. They gotta finish drinking their water. After you're done, you can either go shower now and get ready for bed and then we can do all your homework or you guys can shower afterward. You guys can decide what you wanna do. But we have to get your reading done, Perry. Reese, we gotta go over all of your um, states and capitals 
and then we both have your math assignments to do. Daddy Coco is home. Girls are doing their homework. You guys, it is dark outside now, and the sun sets pretty quick. 6.55 it arm. sets. It's now 7.58. And then what we do is Corey will actually come and sit in here too and we'll get Rhett. And we just do all three kids together and literally it is more of a process to work with Rhett than it is Reese and Perry. We can get Reese and Perry done like that. Don't you think, Cor? And then, but Rhett just takes a little longer. There's Rhett. Yeah, okay, so Rhett, go um, yeah. get your stuff and let's come sit down. Rhett and Corey have joined us now. And so, yep, this is what it looks like, no joke about every evening so during the week for school. Kesley is upstairs. She does her own homework on her own. She does a great job. Actually, she gets great grades. She's been really good. Like, I think we don't really have to worry too much about Kesley getting her homework done. These ones, you know, just making sure they stay caught up in school with their reading and things. Reading's really crucial, especially at this, like, the ages they're at. But reading helps with everything. Reading helps I've with, reading reading helps with math, believe it or not. Reading helps with everything it's all comprehension and things and so we feel very strongly to help make sure our kids are reading at least 20 minutes a night after this usually it's kind of what we'll do either sometimes perry and i will read some books like well before she goes to bed and it actually is a great way to get your kids to get tired as they read their eyes get tired and then they fall asleep a lot quicker and easier, which is a great way to do it. And, you know, it's good to get them reading some books. This is boring. <laughs> Perry's doing her math. It's kind of fun. This is, what, this is what it is right here, guys. Right here. Homework is done. We are now doing school lunches. Reese and Perry are the only ones out of my kids that eat at school. Kesley and Rhett both get out of school before they even serve lunch. They can take snacks into classes and that is what their teachers have thought would be okay, but they do not eat in the cafeteria. But the kids' elementary school does. And while Corey's down here doing that, I'm gonna go check on Kesley and see how she is doing with her homework. We're gonna check in with her and see how things are going. So after they make their lunches, Reese and Perry and Rhett take showers at night and then Rhett takes one again in the morning because he likes to wake up that way. They'll be doing that tonight before bed and Corey and I will just kind of lock up the house, make sure the kitchen's clean, the dishwasher started and all that jazz. Kesley? Yeah. Can I come in? Are you doing homework? Mm-hmm, totally. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, just tell me, did you do your homework already? Mm-hmm. Promise? Yeah, I promise. Okay, because I'm gonna log on to your school thing and make sure everything's all good. You're all caught up on your assignments. Yep, all caught up. <laughs> That's another thing too, you guys. Corey and I get on and we check if your kids are missing any assignments. So it's really nice, we can check that often and see if they're missing assignments. And <sighs> Kesley is dying over here. Rhett, Kesley, Brock, and Boston are playing among us, and they're literally talking right now. I don't even know if you can see. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, that's funny. Hey, what's up? All right. Enjoy I promise yourself. I did my homework. Okay. Bye bye. Got Reese here out of the shower. Perry's out of the shower. Rhett's going to go get in the shower right now. We're going to say goodnight to the kids. Kesley's still talking with Brock in the other room and then she's gonna go to bed too. Teeth are brushed, prayers are said, and it is time for bed. And Reese has got a retainer in. It's a clear, you can't see it, but it's a clear one. Yep, kinda cool. Give me a kiss. Mwah. Night Reese's peanut butter cups. Mwah. I love, love you. Love you too. Good night, love your faces. Good night. See you in the morning. Love you. Love you too. Good night, Kiss. Good night. See you in the morning. Night, Brock. See ya. Bye. Ah. <laughs> good night, Rhett. Good night. See you in the morning. I need to take a shower. Okay, good night. Kids are in bed. Rhett's in the shower. I'm ending the video here, you guys. I'm gonna say good night. Taking the dogs outside one last time before Corey and I go to bed. And this is how we are officially ending our night right here. Good girls, going bodies. That is it for our video. I'm gonna head to bed now, turn off the lights. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you again, HelloFresh, for sponsoring today's video. Bye, guys.